Fox Toledo News at 6.30 starts right now. A South Toledo parent says it's too dangerous for her kids to walk to school because of the more than 200 nearby sex offenders. Good evening, everyone. I'm Sean Haggerty. And I'm Laura Emerson. Here is your news for Thursday, September 2nd. Walking is most likely the option for many TPS students because of the transportation cuts, but one mom's upset. She doesn't want her kids walking through shady neighborhoods. Here's Allison Brown with how the family's dealing with this. Yeah, so the trail's that way. Victoria Szymanski walks with her 7th grader to Jones Junior High. After that, she takes her two sons to Walbridge Elementary. It's a lot of exercise, but she's not risking her family's safety. Depending on which route her 12-year-old daughter takes, this mom knows there are several sex offenders in nearby neighborhoods. It makes walking to school even more dangerous in her eyes. I was very upset. I just kept thinking about her safety and all the different um, child molesters and sex offenders and everything else that she would have to walk within that stretch. As an alternative, Szymanski tells her daughter to take a different route to school sometimes. She has to walk down the trail and then take the Collingwood exit and uh, that's just too far across busy roads. But this isn't necessarily safer either since there's plenty of traffic along the Anthony Wayne Trail. The mother of three says she's at a loss without TPS transportation and unfortunately the option to ride Tarda isn't in the budget and she also believes it's not the safest either. They won't expect you to pay $40 a month and she would have to transfer downtown to stand downtown. With the early morning winter hours, I don't want her downtown in the dark. TPS is expected to receive $7.6 million federal dollars soon from the jobs bill and board president Bob Vasquez is hoping to focus on transportation with that money. Szymanski says it can't come soon enough. Allison Brown, Fox Toledo News. So do you worry about sex offenders when your child walks to school? It's our Fox Toledo feedback question for the night. You can comment on Facebook, Twitter, or send us an email.